is. Emily Elizabeth Dickinson, poet. I am in love with Emily Dickinson, infatuated, obsessed. I am an actress. I'm not a playwright. And I'm not a dressmaker either. So what am I trying to do? I know what I don't want to do. I don't want to write a piece of historical fiction like this, or a play like this, in which the playwright puts words in the poet's mouth. That's what I don't want to do. What I want is to be Emily's mouthpiece. But how do I perform that without getting in her way? Here in her letters is Emily in her own words. I can be her mouthpiece after all. I don't have to put words in her mouth. All I have to do is edit the 1,049 letters into a play. <laughs> what could be simpler? Perhaps she took Ralph Waldo Emerson's words to heart when he wrote, the poet must embrace solitude as a bride. Perhaps she took those words literally and that's why she wore white. Among her contemporaries, Emily could find no one to match her intellectually. She wrote, all men say, what, <laughs> to me? As writing was Emily's passion, so acting is mine and has been ever since I was four years old and saw my first play and announced to my parents the next day that I was going to be an actress when I grow up. Ever since I first met Emily, I have wanted to be her. Well, <laughs> portray her. No. Be her. Get inside Emily's dress.